My name is Cannabis Rollins. My journey is beginning. A journey that I hope will open the doors of life to me and link my past with my future. A journey that will bring me to a strange and dark place. From Hammerfell to Skyrim to a house called Rollinwood. A world that I have never known with people I have never met. People who tonight are still only shadows in my mind, but who will soon fill the days and nights of my tomorrow. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. I've just completed all of the burglary jobs in Windhelm, and it's now nice it's time. You need to start doing some work. You're the laziest bunch of thieves I've ever seen. But now, after five burglaries in Windhelm, it's time for me to talk to Delvin and see if he has anything for me. Something special. I don't know what you're made of, but I've never seen anyone tackle this many jobs without ending up dead or in jail. We got half of Skyrim back under our wing, and the coin's starting to flow. There, if you're ready, I've got another special job for you. So, what is this special request? Got word from Torsten Cruelsey in Windell. Cruelsey? The guild is trying to get itself started. Not only that, but they're giving us thieves a bad name by murdering their marks. Get over there and see what you can do. <laughs> Very well. Find me if you're ever looking for some extra coin. Alright, Bandit, let's go. Sounds like a guild that I'd rather be a part of, since they're killing people. Yes? All right, it's back to Windhelm. There. That brat ain't mine. Could be anyone. Nothing like maintaining a mortal appearance. All right, so where is this person I'm supposed to speak with? He must be outside here somewhere. Look at this dawn guard. There he is. Yes? You there. I own Hollyfrost Farm outside the city. It's honest work, if a bit dull. Yes, you must be Torsten Cruel C. Delvin Mallory said you had a job for me. My daughter Fiotli. Fiotli? She was murdered a few no. months ago. Left her laying on the ground in a pool of her own blood. I assumed they were after her valuables. She always wore far too much jewelry in public. And I told her it'd be the death of her. I never thought. Well, unfortunately, I can assure you it wasn't anyone from the guild that I belong to. They're too afraid to kill. No need to explain. I'm well aware of your guild's methods. It took me weeks, but I finally tracked down to kill her. A bloody Altmer at that. Can you imagine? And what happened to him? 
Let's just say I'm a firm believer in an eye for an eye and leave it at that. He fancied himself a thief in some sort of new guild forming around here. Gave me some valuable information before... No rough stuff. Well, me. And what exactly do you need me to do? Well, like I told Delvin, I think we can help each other. You recover what I'm looking for and take out a rival guild in the process. It's something they took from Fiot Lei, I assume? Exactly. One of the pieces stolen from her was a silver locket. A cruel sea family heirloom. I want it back. Very well, then. Where do I begin? The only name I have is Naranya. Has a house right here in Windhelm. That's where you should begin looking. All right. Should have been an adventurer like you instead of a farmer. Yes. You certainly have the pension for murder. All right, let's go, bandit. You know, it's quite odd running around in broad daylight in a nightingale uniform. A few septums for my supper is all I ask. Looks like they have other problems here in Windhelm with some sort of serial killer. But I'm not going to get myself involved in that just yet. Well, we have a crowd over here. Gentlemen, excuse me. I need to speak with Naranye. Yes, can I help you with something? I'm here about Fiotle. Fiotle? Fiotle. Where have I heard that name? Oh, of course the poor girl who was murdered. Such a beautiful young thing. A tragedy, to be certain. There seems to be a lot of murder going on around here in Windhelm. But I can see right through you. I know you're involved in her death. How dare you! How dare you! Me of taking part in such a, such a heinous act? I should have you arrested for even suggesting such a thing. How dare you! How dare me! You might be a decent thief, but you're an awful actor. Now, just a moment. Let's think about this. You know, discuss it like two rational people. I'm listening. Look, I had no choice. They're crazy. I could be killed. We all could. And who is crazy? It's a guild of ultimate thieves. They call themselves the Somerset Shadows. Their leader, Linway, he's the worst of the lot. He steals valuables from the dead. He must enjoy it. You mean he murders? <coughs> Excuse me, Naranya. Let me clear my throat. <coughs> You know, sometimes drinking too much blood, it starts to coagulate. So, you mean he murders his marks? No. Linwe prefers stealing from the deceased. Digs up the corpses, breaks into the hall of the dead. <laughs> he even stole that locket right off that poor murdered girl's body. Or what was left of it. Sounds like Linwe has some issues that I need to look after. And how did you get involved? I used to fence for the Thieves' Guild in Skyrim a long time ago. When Linwe moved into the area, he contacted me and said if I didn't fence for them, he'd kill me. Tell me where Linwe's hiding. If I tell you, you need to promise not to kill me. <laughs> I'd prove to be quite an asset to the Thieves' Guild. Really? One of the best fences in Skyrim. Everyone's a fence. But I'm not going to kill you. Not yet, anyway. <sighs> Linway is holed up in a place called Uttering Hills Cave. He's got his entire guild there, so be careful. After you're done with all this, come back any time and I'll make good on my end of the bargain. I'm sure you will. So tell me more about what happened to Fiotle. I don't know. Rumor has it she was murdered, butchered by a madman. 
I really try and stay out of such things. Torsten might think Linway or myself are responsible for Fjorki's death, but I can assure you nothing could be further from the truth. More lies, really? I'm sorry I misled you. Return when this is over, and we'll talk about my involvement in the thieves. Yes, game. yes, I yes. haven't got all day. But more importantly, we'll talk about how long you'll have There's left to live. Let's Who go, is? bandit. Excuse me, citizen. Like One should never pay too much attention to rumors, Torbjorn. You have huh? More Dawn Guard. All right, let's see where this. What is it? Uttering Hills Cave is located. It's far enough. All right, I think we're going to travel to Morvunskar. No, you don't. What? Is someone there? Uh, look at this. Mages. really don't have time for this. I am master of the arcade. Oh boy. Bandit, where did you go? All right, they're using fire. Be careful. Bandit. What? All right. It looks like they've all been dispatched. Good work. I'm wondering if I should be worried that the bandit is. Almost supremely powerful. All right, let's get some food. Drink up, bandit. All right, what's the fastest way out of here? Like I'm supposed to figure out which college he meant. I think there are few, a few more corpses that I can feed off of. Look into the city of free man. All right, let's go. It's off in this direction. All right. I think this is their camp. And we're not going to have much of an option with it being out in the open like this, but to charge in and kill them. But it's not going to be me that's doing the charging. Form. No, you don't. All right. 
right. Even wearing Thieves Guild armor. Interesting. Certainly a good way to discredit the Thieves Guild. All right, this is the place uttering hill. Did handle this myself. This is personal. Yes. Wait here. As you say. someone. <laughs> what was that? Someone would say it's your death. See, I could go in either direction. Wait a minute. Why don't I just have a little assistance to go along with this, or are they too powerful? No, they're not. There's a way there. I think that's how we need to go. But let's see if anyone else is wandering these caverns. That completes the circle. Gonna start 
start keeping a knife in my boot. Tired of disarmed. <laughs> oh, someone's here, all right. It's a shame your usefulness has ended. Is there anything else here that I need to know about? It's time for me to revert back. There. All right, I see levers and a door. Let's see, what do we need to do here? sort of puzzle. Hmm, there doesn't appear to be anything of value back here. <laughs> All right, let's see about uh burning this banner. You've got to love it. This works on beehives, but not on a piece of cloth. And I have no flame spells. over 
here. <laughs> All right. And what do we have here? Oh, let me feed. Ah, here it is, Fioldley's locket. And I can take his armor. It's a shame. I'm not going to be able to burn this. The only other thing I have are arrows, and I'm not sure they're going to set anything on fire. So much for that. So I take it that only a flame spell would be able to take that down. This way, but maybe it was this way. I can't think of any other way to burn that. Gonna start keeping a knife in my That's boot. crazy. I'm tired of getting this up. Yes? I have fire, but I can't burn the banner. Follow Excellent. me. Excellent. What's this over here?
alteration shrine. Retire someday. Give myself an island. remember exactly what that's supposed to do. Talk to Cruel Sea. Torsten. Hollyfrost Farm outside the city. Yes, it's I'm, honest work, I'm aware. All right, I have Fiotle's locket. It pains me to see this locket. To be reminded of Fiotle once more, but I'm glad it's back where it belongs. Tell Delvin that if he still desires to have my support for the Thebes Guild in Windhelm, he's got it. Yes, I will. I should have been an adventurer like you instead of a farmer. <laughs> All right, let's head back to the Thieves Guild. Jobs for Vex. How about you? Brynjolf. Things are looking up around here, lad. Yes, they are. in bed again. Come on. Ah, need me some scorn. Need some gold. But I have some work for you. Uh, I'm here to let you know that I've finished that special job in Windhelm. Tolston was gratified the death of his daughter was avenged, and the heirloom was returned. At this very moment, he's laying the groundwork for the guild to re-establish itself in Windhelm. <laughs> I wish you could have sent more of a message to those Somerset Shadows upstarts, but hopefully they'll stay out of our business. Success means the guild is getting stronger. We've picked up another merchant and a new recruit. Mm, very Being well. a thief is like a second skin for you, ain't it? Never seen anything like it. If you don't watch out, you might even earn Vex's respect. That'd have be something, eh? Yes, I suppose it would be. But I would have sent a stronger message if physics worked as it should have. I had the fire, but the banner wouldn't light. All right, good day. There's plenty more work for the likes of you. Oh, and there's plenty for you, too. Don't try to put it all on me. All right, let's see, Bandit. I think we have one more. Walk into the city of Freeman. Reputation quest. Let's just stroll through the area here. We have some new shops. Very nice. Very nice indeed. What was he thinking? Fool never saw me pull that ace out of my boot. Yes. Oh, look. I can actually work on my equipment. <laughs> All right. 
things are certainly coming along. Gonna start keeping 